Hello everyone, welcome to Bargain Gaming, where we can play excellent games without busting our wallets. This is episode 51 of Outer Worlds. So we have discovered, we're going through the nook and crannies of uh, I don't even know where we are. If we look at the map, where are we? Uh, the Lost Hope Bar Vendor. Oh, we're behind uh, the Lost Hope. We're behind the bar of Lost Hope. Uh, let's see if people will see us. Oh, that's a lost hope. And this one? Oh, that's the kitchen. Oh, okay. Okay, let's get out of here. And then we need to go down one level, right? Uh, to find out uh, why is that guy being held? No, not here. Uh, if you can hear me, please hurry. The toilet's overflowed on me at least twice. Okay, let's save this so that if uh, the guy does not deserve to be let out, uh, I don't know. <laughs> we can always reload this. Nice. Thank you, stranger. Shit, ain't that a relief? You have no idea how good the air on Groundbreaker smells until you've been trapped in a tiny bathroom with an overflowing toilet. Thanks again, friend. What happened? What usually happens on this partially pressurized rust bucket? Something broke. Well, actually two things broke. First, the damn toilet overflowed. When I came to clean that up, the damn door decided to close and lock on me. Time stood still. I was aware of nothing but the smell. Ugh, could have been days. Ah, shit. That means I haven't clocked out in days. Song is gonna have my ass for wage theft. <laughs> You're gonna shake me down after I was trapped in a shit-covered bathroom? Is that how it is? Fine. Here's every bit I've got. Is that enough for you? Or do you want my shit-covered clothes as well? <laughs> Keep your pants on, smartass. <laughs> You're a sick woman. I never should have come here. <laughs> Yikes, look at all that mess down there. Yuck! Man. But it says like a, like a panel or something. We should look for a panel or something. Like a loose panel. Oh man. What's our current mission right now? Okay, I'm just checking what is our current mission. Oh. Passage to anywhere. Oh, inform Dr. Wells you have a nav key. That is the main quest. Uh, let's do this. Uh, talk to Dr. Wanda Dorset in the sick bay. One of the local doctors has been waiting for a shipment. Oh, yeah, that was the very first thing we were asked to. Uh, 
to check out. I think this one here is where we... What? No. No, not this one. This is where... Wow, I am confused. I thought... Yeah, this one. We came in through here. Okay. Do we want to open this? Let me save this in case uh, it turns out to be a bad decision. What is this? No, 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 no. in here wow this is very interesting stuff Ooh, lots of ammo ammo what is this Heavy machine gun, yes! I wonder where we are. Uh, heavy ammo, yes. Where are we? Uh, Oh, Bella Shell. So this is Bella Shell's inventory. Okay. <laughs> okay, I guess that was worth it. Anything else? Then we just need to... Uh... Right? Uh, yeah, we've been there. What were we trying to do? Uh, talk to Dr. Dorset in Sick Bay. Uh, medical Bay. Can we just walk in there? Hey, Doc. Can't say I've seen you before. I take it you're a freighter, Captain? If you're here to better yourself, you'll have to wait. We're having a spot of trouble with our delivery service. Wheeler told me to tell you to get off his ass about your shipment. Did he now? The mouth on that man. I swear his late mother'd be ashamed. He must be referring to Erion. I'm sure the fool's gotten himself into another scrape. I'm beginning to wonder if I'm ever going to get my service mechanicals at this rate. Oh, uh, who's Irian? Our delivery man. 
A brave idiot with a penchant for getting himself delayed. Sometimes by dates, usually by bandits. <laughs> Surgery mostly. Medical personnel are difficult to come by on Groundbreaker. What's that? The board won't let their doctors and nurses station here, and they own all the medical schools. If we can't hire their people, we can't hire anyone. Everyone on staff here on Groundbreaker was trained by me or Idris. We're good, don't get me wrong. But we've only two heads between us, and we don't know everything. Uh, I could find him. I'd be grateful if you'd spare the time. We need his delivery soon as yesterday. Last he told me, he was taking a shortcut by Scylla, an asteroid in the Charybdis cluster. That's where I'd start, were I the adventuring type. You look out, though. The place is probably crawling with outlaws. Okay, we... Oh, this is very good. We actually got a quest out of that one. Okay, uh, <laughs> this is very interesting stuff. Okay, find Captain on Scylla. Uh, acquire science weapon on Groundbreaker. Now, yeah, the logs on Hawthorne's terminal mentioned rumors from the Groundbreaker of a scientist who bragged about a powerful weapon he was researching. Perhaps more details can be found on the station. Another of Hawthorne's logs mentioned looking for Gladys shop of old records. Apparently the smuggler acquired several leads that way. Review the Hephaestus mining on Hawthorne's terminal. Uh, so where are so we have to go there oh we were here before okay meter oh here inside okay uh oh there are bad people in here I can see what red I served us uh, on two freighters before yeah we got this right we we looked at that one before Right? He says again, yeah. I served on two corporate freighters before I got stranded here. Everyone's heard my sob story, but no one's listening. To them, I'm just background radiation. Wasn't my fault the captain decided to take off early. Wasn't my fault no one checked the crew manifest. Wasn't my fault they replaced me with a full timer. Now I'm a filthy, bitless, and bedless. For anyone's concern, I'm groundbreaker trash. That's how I live. And if no one agrees to take me on a honest crew, I suppose uh, that's how I'll die. Yeah, we were in here. Uh, Yeah, we came over here. Okay, so did that improve our journal? So we were led to this area, right? Oh, 13 meters, 12 meters.
we came in from here twelve meters. Are we getting farther away? That's eleven meters. Nine. Uh nope. Yeah, we were here earlier. We're now 19 meters away. And, uh... 1.4 meters. Captain's terminal. What is that? We just saw the captain's terminal. Huh. It must be on the other side of the wall. Uh oh, ah, yeah, this is where uh, the Holograph works. Uh, it's upstairs, though. It's one level up. Yeah, we went up there, but uh, I don't think... Uh, pick optional uh, rest... Okay, let me, let me uh, save this. Showing seventeen twenty one meters. What's on this other side? Somebody's in here, huh? Hmm. It is not at this level, is it? No, it's not. It's, uh...
I I am a little stumped. Okay, anyway, what we can do is let's go check uh, on our ship because that's the other thing that we can do is that uh, and then we can arm out uh, we can outfit out the uh, dock. Because we need to go to to our ship to use Hawthorne's uh, Hawthorne's terminal to study the items that we bought from Gladys. I'm missing something on the uh, groundbreaker. It's just right there. It's just because uh... we're like it's like a captain's terminal. It's like somebody's just on the opposite wall. Where are we headed today, Captain? The stars are the limit. Okay, uh, navigational terminal. Talk. Uh... What did it say? It says uh, review Hephaestus mining activity uh, archive on Hawthorne's terminal. Welcome back, Captain. Now that you have acquired a nav key to Stellar Bay, would you like me to contact Dr. Wells? Mm, not now. How about here? Where is our terminal? Or is it in our room? Okay, it's in our room. Acquired a science weapon on Groundbreaker. Acquired a science weapon on Scylla. Research results uh, from the site supervisor's personal logs. That captain sold Harris something called the Rearranger, then left before we discovered the damn thing doesn't work. Only thing it rearranged is the number of bits on Harris's cart. Looks like some strange tech or of a weapon. Maybe a scientist can make something of it. Result number two from the site safety officer's incident report. Doc Caulfield couldn't save Lamb. Now I gotta arrest Harris for his murder. Confiscated that weapon he used and stored it in Bertie's office for now. Figured the least the site supervisor can do is fill out the forms for whatever that damn thing is. I don't know how I'm going to detain Harris. Not like we got prison cells on this rock. From Barber's coronary request, inquest. Lemwell, family name. Harry Ford, employment, indentured. Contract, 35 years. Cause of deceasement, blunt force trauma, weapons unknown. Took a good whack to the noggin. The facial area to be Specifical about it. It's all twisted up too. Nose is five times too big. Jaw is shrunk to almost nothing. Teeth are all, all, all out of kilter. Though I suppose that was true predeceasement. If the blow didn't, did, itself didn't kill him, there's no way he could have breathed with all that damage. So it's called what? Uh, rearranger. So now, rearranger. Uh, weapons from the void. Find Captain Ancilia. Acquire. Okay. Weapons from the void. Uh, now we can. Uh, let's go get. What kind of uh, our inventory is like? 
uh, for twenty six, and this is twenty two. Okay, we can give that to Ellie. So Ellie comes uh, armed with an auto mag and a officer spine uh, and has barely anything. This is level 22. This is level 26. What is that? Uh, oh, tech skills plus five. And this one is 26, 22, 22, 26. That needs repair. Uh, and then her weapon. No, her perk. Yeah. Increase 30 points. 10% uh, range damage. Oh, they all need 20% chance to reset ability cooldown on ability use. 30% companion ability damage. 30% equip time. 30% range weapon reload speed. Recover 25 health when fatally wounded. Cooldown 5 minutes. Uh, I don't know. Uh... Okay, uh, let's not do the last one first. Uh, okay, uh, and then... Okay, uh, let me cut the episode right here. Uh, thank you guys for joining me. I hope you'll join me in the next episode. Bye!